a lot of my life's been spent up in the Blue Mountains. Funny thing, like even if I just get close to the rocks, I still get that sort of release of energy or adrenaline or whatever it is. It's been 20 years now with climbing and you know, it's the, the act of climbing that I love. I love to have something in front of me that I'm working towards, be that with work or with fun and play. That's definitely something that drives me. I like change, I like a challenge. I'm a .NET developer and I used to be a dietitian. My journey to become a developer all started trying to make some software uh, for the nutrition industry. During that time I was like, well, I better start picking up some coding to learn and that's where it all began. As a dietitian, I've already done so much study. All up, it's kind of seven years of full-time university. I just wasn't interested in going through that same process again. So I was looking for more ways to learn and very quickly gravitated towards Pluralsight. And through that process, just totally fell in love with development. Had no idea that I would love everything from JavaScript to HTML, all, all that stuff. I just, I just fell in love with all of it. A huge part of that was Pluralsight. Being able to plug into the best content and learn and learn quickly in the visual format that I love to do was just gold, it was awesome. There was maybe a nine month period where I was just doing lots of Pluralsight all the time, still working professionally as a dietitian, but in my spare time I couldn't wait to get home to, to learn some more technology stuff. But it quickly led to me this position where I was like, I can't do both anymore. I kind of have to make a decision because now I'm doing not so good a job at nutrition because I've got so much focus on technology. And I turned up at this uh, course called Fire Boot Camp in Sydney which is a nine week course for people who already have experience to become like enterprise.net developers. So I was pretty nervous turning up because all I'd ever done really is just teach myself in my bedroom using Pluralsight. But I was really surprised that I was able to keep up and at the end of the course, the people who ran the course uh, actually offered me work. So it was a real surprise to me to move straight into being part of a team and, and doing development full time. I was on this mission to become technically competent and you finally get there and then you start teaching other people that drive to always be learning the latest and greatest, working towards that next adventure. That's definitely been like a huge core of my life. Some years you look back and you think, oh yeah, what happened that year and you can't really piece it together. But I think if you were to say 2014 for me, I think for the rest of my life, I'd be like, oh, that's the time where I made the jump across from being a dietitian to a developer.